Occupunk would say it connected to Wi-Fi. <laughs> it was already connected. So it's kind of like it's looking like it's just pulsing, connect, unconnect, connect. And because uh, the other day, that's what it was doing. It just connect and disconnect, connect and disconnect. And uh, it was getting kind of crazy. So, uh, I'm kind of thinking it's more of a Verizon thing than it is anything else. Uh, it is kind of crazy. So anyway, I've had it. I don't know about a year and a half, and I've worked it pretty hard. <laughs> so it may may be about its lifespan. Yeah, I still got a little hockey puck uh, swapped out and put one of them regular routers up in the house for. I can always revert to that. I'm thinking about dropping that Verizon home phone and it's kind of a waste of 20 bucks a month. But uh, I think I've only got another month or so and that contract will be done. And I may get rid of that one and put the hockey puck back up again. I don't know. I guess it's kind of nice having it to plug in, but I can always put a regular router on it, do the same thing. Man, I got uh, one of those Vo Vonet uh, routers, and uh, I don't know how many uh, connectors you can put in. I've got five in it right now, and all I do is just turn off the hockey puck, it switches on over to the uh, other internet, or when I get in the car, I can turn on my phone and tether it, and it'll go to it. And uh, I can turn off the tether on the phone, and turn on the hockey puck, it'll go to it. And uh, man, this thing works pretty good. I have bought two of them, and one of them quit real early and quit working. But this one I'm using now has actually been running a good while. So, uh, <laughs> that one didn't last too long, and it quit. But, uh, and then, of course, my little jumbo spot, you can hook three different things, I think, to it. And, uh, then the, the other Shark RF I've 